Welcome to the Undersea Classroom. Today we're going to explore the mysteries of lightning. Are you ready? Let's explore together. The first question is, why does lightning occur? Oh, that's a curious one. Lightning happens because of the accumulation of static electricity within clouds. When positive and negative charges repel each other, they generate an electric discharge, creating lightning. The next question is, why is lightning accompanied by thunder? When lightning occurs, it rapidly heats the air, causing the air to expand, creating sound waves, which is what we hear as thunder. Now let's talk about why lightning comes in different shapes. Lightning can take on various forms, such as cloud-to-ground lightning, cloud-to-cloud -cloud lightning, and ground-to-ground -ground lightning, depending on the discharge path and cloud formations. Moving on, we'll explain why lightning can ignite trees. Lightning generates a significant amount of heat and energy, enough to start fires in trees or buildings. That's why we need to be cautious around thunderstorms. The last question is, why shouldn't we play in thunderstorms? Thunderstorms are very dangerous because they can strike the ground at any time, producing high temperatures and currents that pose a risk to humans and animals so it's best to stay in a safe place when there's a thunderstorm. Well, kids, lightning is a fascinating phenomenon of nature, but it also demands caution. Keep your curiosity alive and continue exploring the mysteries of nature. See you next time.